All right class, that'll be all for today. Let me remind you all that we're having another test tomorrow. So, make sure to study when you get back home today. See you tomorrow. Oh, man. Not another stupid test again. Why do we have to write a test every freaking week? This is so annoying. Later. Hey Classic Caillou, it's time for dinner. Okay. I'll be coming, once I'm done with my game. You can leave now. Can't you just pause it, and come back to it when you're done eating? Besides, have you forgotten, we're having another English test tomorrow? Shouldn't you be studying instead of playing games? Shut up! I've told you many many times before. That it's none of your damn business, if I play my video games, or whatever I do. Do I look like I care about any freaking test? So, mind your own damn business, and get out of my room before I give you a punishment day. Oh, no, please don't give me a punishment day, I hate punishment day. So get your poopy pants out of here. Okay. The next day. Alright, Caillou and Rosie. Are you ready for me to drop you off at school today? Yes, Dad. I'm so happy that you're driving us to school, and we don't have to take the bus. Me too. Rosie's happy to go to school in Dad's car, and not the bus. Alright then, Caillou and Rosie. Let's go. Wait a minute. What about classic Caillou? I am sure, he's still in his room sleeping. Ugh. That boy? <sighs> oh my gosh! What was that for? Shut up! How many times have I warned you about eating late, and playing stupid video games all night? Then, you start sleeping for hours, snoring like a pig, don't you know, that you have school this morning? Or do you want to walk to school with your legs again? Oh no. Please don't make me walk to school, then my legs will hurt so bad. Then, get your lazy jerky bum outside now, or I'm leaving you. The next day. Hey Classic Caillou. Are you prepared for English test today? You always score zero in all of your tests, so I hope you studied for this one. Test? What test are you talking about? What? Have you forgotten? Miss Faye said we're going to be having another English test today. I don't want to write any dumb test today. But, what am I going to do now? Brain Blast. I'm going to pull the fire alarm, so there will no longer be any class today. I am so smart. Hey class. It's so good to see you again today. As I already told you yesterday, we'll be having another test again today. So, I hope that you've all studied very well, for today's test. We're going to begin now. Excuse me Miss Faye. Yes, Classic Caillou, is there something you want to say? Yes, I wanted to ask if I could use the toilet, before we begin test today? Sure, Classic Caillou. But be sure to make it quick, because we won't wait for you. Okay. Yes! There's the fire alarm. I'm going to pull it, now, so I can finally escape this dumb test. Now. I'm going to begin sharing your papers, so, just take it, and answer your questions quietly. Oh my god. That's the fire alarm. Everyone needs to leave the class immediately. Yes! Finally. This is so much fun, I'm such a genius genius. Later. Hello sir. Are you the principal? Yes, I am. Is everything okay, officer? Fortunately, it was a false alarm, and there was no fire. However, we found out, that someone must have pulled the fire alarm, as a sort of prank or something, so we checked the fire alarm, and we found fingerprints. Belonging to one of your students named Classic Caillou. What? 
No 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 no. That boy is my worst student ever. He misbehaves and scores zero in all of his tests every freaking time, and now. He has taken things too far, and I'm definitely suspending him big time. Classic Caillou Jacob Anderson. You're under arrest for public disturbance. You have the right to remain silent or whatever you say can and will be used against you. Good day Mr. Anderson. I'm not happy to see you. And I am so 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 angry and mad because this is the third time your son has been in jail already just in less than a month. Your son pulled the fire alarm and caused a false alarm disturbing everyone's peace and disrupting everyone's day. This is a very serious crime, and because this isn't his first time, I am setting bail at $20,000. Oh my gosh! Officer, I don't have $20,000 to pay for bail, where am I gonna get it? Shut up! I don't freaking care. Whether you sell your car, or sell your house, or whatever. Your son is not getting out of jail, until you pay $20,000, period. Classic. Gale. Lou. Jacob. Freaking. Anderson. You are the worst kid on the face of this planet. You caused a freaking false alarm, and ended up in jail for the third time. Not to mention, you just got suspended again, and now. Because of you, I had to sell my brand new Tesla, to pay $20,000, in stupid bail. You are literally getting the biggest grounding of your entire life, because I am permanently grounding you. Never, ever, ever, to be ungrounded, ever again. Two thousand years later. What? Where am I? Hey Boris, my name is Angel Michael. It's been two thousand years, and you're dead now. I'm here to tell you. That if you don't unground your son classic Caillou, we can't let you stay in heaven, because if you don't, we have to send you, to hell. No, I don't care. He's never getting ungrounded, and that's final. <laughs>